Hey guys, Father and Son Adventures of Iowa. We use uh, two liter bottles to collect our dirty water because the Sawyer Squeeze and the Sawyer Mini thread right onto them. And, and I'm, I just use two liter bottles for my dirty water. They're cheap enough and they're easy to collapse to put pressure on the Sawyer Squeeze. And they don't weigh anything. But what I'm going to show you is how I attach this cordage. And it makes for a nice handle to strap around the um, tree with a bungee or whatever. And anyway, it's three knots. It's a, a clove hitch, um, overhand knots, and a square knot right there. So I'll re readjust the camera here and I'll show you on that one liter bottle. Okay guys, so I've got just some cordage. It's not, it's a little bit lighter than paracord. Um, you get yourself two or three feet um, and find, find the half. And make a loop in the half. And then you take, I'm gonna try to do this so you guys can see it. Um, I just reached over and made two loops and then you fold them together like this. I'll do that again. We got our half here. I'm reaching over and grabbing this side and I'm grabbing this side and I've got my hands crossed because when I bring my loops back together and that brings it just right and you just fold it right behind all right now that's going to go around the bottle cap there's a little ledge right there right underneath where they mold this and you just pull your cordage tight and that's not going to come undone until you make it come undone the tighter the more weight that's on this the tighter it becomes. All right, so then part way down, we just do an overhand knot. Tighten that up. We'll do another one. Part way down, do an overhand knot. That gives you a couple places to put a carabiner on your pack. All right, and now the the Diet Coke or Coke bottles work good because they've got actual, they try to simulate the old glass bottle shape. So it's got an Im, uh, imprint here um, where they've molded it. And so as you take this bottom knot, you'll wrap both pieces around like that and it uh, is just a perfect place for placement and then we're just going to tie a uh, square knot if I get in the way I'm sorry so we got a uh, square knot we got right over left Oops. right over left tighten it up then we got left over right. And if it's a square knot, you should be able to tell it that it's not a granny knot because it you can unlatch it like that. And then you can just cut your extra excess off. Um, this makes it handy for dipping it in the water, handy for carrying, or handy for putting a carabiner on it. I hope that's been helpful. This is not my original idea. I borrowed this from Dave's Passage. And uh, I'll, if I remember to, I'll put a link of his channel on here. And I'm, I'm pretty sure he saw it somewhere too. Thanks for watching, guys.